is Johnson's Beach, Pensacola, Florida, Perdido. This beach was wiped out in Katrina, and they restored it back. Now it looks like we're going to get wiped out with oil. There's miles of sugar white sand here. This being a national park, probably will try to be protected, but it's right on the Gulf of Mexico, so it's going to be tough. Should be able to see the Gulf out there. Today's Sunday, May 2nd, I think. It's about noon. These people just sitting here in cars just looking at stuff. I'm learning in other cars. These roads drift shut all the time have to plow them. You can see the plow marks on the edge of the of this road here from the dunes blowing through. A mouse that's protected in this area. Turtles. Turtles Beach here. Lay their eggs. I'm not seeing much here but the mounds before the gulf. This is kind of desolate area out here. There's nothing to build out here. We're looking southeast getting ready to turn around here. Because it comes to an end here. We're going to head back to the west on Johnson's Beach. And this is the intercoastal, caught, intercoastal waterway you're looking at now trying to do is, I think, protect the intercoastals and the bays with the booms and try to save these areas that are in the intercoastal. That's the hope. It would be bad enough if the oil gets up on the Gulf Shores, but if it comes up into these intercoastals, this is where a lot of your manatees and your dolphins and stuff like that end up because these air, these waters here are protected. You can see how calm they are. Beautiful day today. Must be about 80 at least. Humid, hazy. No sign of the oil, no, no smell yet. They're predicting it'll come. 